the audio sound? I'm using a brand new microphone. I pretty much revamped my entire setup. I spent like three grand to try to, I don't know, revamp the setup here. This is exactly what Gunrun uses, minus the camera, since this camera didn't do 60 frames per second. Dude, Gunrun setup is so fucking expensive. He probably got it for free. But dude, it's like three grand for everything. Yo. Okay. I'm gonna turn the audio up here. Hold up. So basically, these new modems stream at a different frequency. They stream at 5.4 gigahertz as opposed to 2. Point something which I've done my research, 5.4 gigahertz is really, it, it's like really bad when you go inside buildings. So I'm like worried about walking inside of a building, but we're gonna test it out. Yo, I just got in a car in the corner. Is that better? Make this bitch loud as fuck. There you go. Ooh, I'm peeking. Peek, 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 peek. Oh, there you go. Okay, I'm not peeking anymore. Okay. That was probably loud as fuck. I might still peek a little bit, but yeah, we'll see. You tell me how it sounds. It tells me. It says I'm peeking, but just barely. My throat still hurts. Actually, it's, I got. I went to the doctor yesterday. I'm like, listen, I need to get better. I got, like, cause the cold usually goes away in like a week. I'm like, I need to get better as soon as possible. I need something that's better than. Uh, I need something that's better than Tylenol. Like, I need to get. I don't want to be sick for a fucking week. And they so they give me an injection of a, some kind of steroid. Huh? I don't have an Instagram. I have a Twitter. That just got verified on today. What's up? Good shit. Hell yeah, bro. Worked hard for that. What are you guys up to? Chilling. Maxing and relaxing. Hell yeah, bro. I like your style. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right, have a good one. <laughs> Verified, by the way, dude. <laughs> okay. Um. I don't even know what else. Oh yeah, I got an injection of some some kind of steroid that uh, makes the cold go away or something. I don't know. I like. I got the injection today. I feel so much better. I still feel like shit, but it feels so much better. What's up? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go to get some food. Let's see if it lags and, or gets pixelated as fuck inside of a building. Let's see how this 5.4 gigahertz frequency does for us. I need to get a stabilizer as well. I'm only holding the GoPro in my hand. GoPro is not that really good, it's not really the best quality. I have better cameras of better quality, but the GoPro is the only thing I have that can actually do 60 frames per second without it being 5.94, which is technically not. 60 frames for the encoder. So I'd, I'd much prefer lower, lower quality, maybe worse lighting, but 60 frames than better quality and better lighting. Like 60 frames is a huge deal. It's like almost, it's so hard though to, to perfect. Like, it's probably not gonna work. As soon as I walk in a building, it's probably gonna get pixelated, but hey, if I could, some, if I could one day perfect 60 frames, dude, that'd be so good. It's so fucking, it's, it looks so like natural. It just looks more, it just looks more real, you know? What do you guys think of the interview with uh, No Jumper? I tried to be 
a little bit more serious, you know. I try to give uh, my thinking. I, I try to be more business oriented behind that podcast. Because when I watch a podcast, I want to learn something. So I try to be informational. I try to give you uh, more of a business, uh, you know, a, a little bit more insight of my business thinking. I fixed the dye in my hair as well. I redyed it. So it's a little bit blue on the top still, but it's not bad. And I was kind of—I was nervous doing the interview, though. I've, I've never been interviewed before like that, so I was like, kind of nervous. Uh, I was like, huh, okay, you know. All right, let's see if this shit pixelates. Hopefully not. Yeah, plain bagel with uh, cream cheese toasted. How you doing? Good, how are you? You know, chilling. Kind of sick. You're sick? Yeah, got an injection of steroid though. I'm sorry. No, no, it's okay. I got an injection of steroid. So it's going to make me feel better, you know? It's going to make me feel good. It's actually working a lot. Yesterday I was super sick. And today, my throat hurts a little bit, but my body, my body feels good. I know you give no fucks. Oh, I do. But, oh, okay. All right, so bagel, cream cheese, toasted. Uh-huh. It's going to be 322. Quality don't look too bad, huh? For me, inside of the building, a little bit pixelated sometimes, but hey, if it's 60 frames, it might it might be worth it might be worth it. If it's pixelated every so often, it might just be worth it for 60 frames, dude. Imagine how good like I don't know, like fight stream would look, 60 frames, or like anything, dude, pretty much. I don't know why I can't stay at such a good bit rate. I have uh, the buffer maxed out at 10, so I have 10 second stream on, or 10 second delay, to give the frames enough time to be encoded. Uh, I wish I could make the buffer like 20, 20 second or something. It just needs like another five seconds of buffer time, and then it'd be good. 10 seconds just ain't enough for like constant movement. The frames just don't have enough time. Or maybe it like has to force out the frames in such low quality to make it fit the time limit. I mean, at least it's not buffering, I'm lagging. Hey, that's a good, that's a fucking, it's the same tarot deck, just different modems. It's the fucking modems that do it. Instead of doing, I have all my, I have six 5.4 gigahertz modems on Sprint, AT&T, Verizon, and T-Mobile. 
so I have like so much fucking, I have so many modems, dude. <laughs> and they're all like way better. They're, they're all at a different frequency than the other modems. So if I was just on 30 frames, I could probably do like 1080 at like 10,000 bit rate with like no issues probably. But I'm trying to, I'm try, I'd rather prefer a higher frame rate than a higher quality to be honest. But then again, if it's like pixelated, it's not really worth, it just depends, dude. Obviously, Danquan's, the one that Danquan was using looked better because, well, he had a better camera. I'm using a GoPro and he was streaming at 30 frames. I was on my other camera and 30 frames would look the same as Danquan's. I'm just trying to push the limit, you know, on 60 frames. We'll have to see. I'm gonna go down, walk down the road again. Maybe 60 frames would only have to be for certain streams. Like if I did UFC X, that 60 frames since we were outside the entire time would be perfect. But like a normal, a normal stream, probably 60 frames would not be good because like, you know, walk inside a building like it pixelated. But it's only if I'm moving. If I walk inside a building, eat like food, go to a restaurant, it's not gonna be like pixelated when I'm sitting down, not moving. It's only when I move. So 60 frames might just be worth it. I had, the only way it gets pixelated, it seems, is if I walk inside of a building and I'm moving a lot. So if I have like something to actually stabilize the camera and it, so it doesn't move as much, it'll be good. So I'm just holding it with my hand right now. I'm like trying to think, it's like the, I'm trying to see like what, what would be better, right? Hey, thanks. Appreciate it. Let's see. Let's go uh, in here and see what pixel is. Hey, the dog's peeing. That's cool. Yeah, it doesn't look bad, huh? Inside this building looks fine. Maybe it's just some buildings that are like really thick. Let's go inside a really thick building and see what happens. Thing, we're, we're, we are using double the frames that we typically use and it hasn't buffered yet, so that's pretty good. You have to understand that 60 frames uses so much bandwidth, dude. It uses so much bandwidth. But I have some unthrottable, unlimited fucking SIM cards, so... I have unlimited bills, six of them. So it should be nice. There's Cornbread's dad, he's looking at me. Hi. It hurts to talk a little bit still. I'm like talking really low. You probably can't tell because the mic's really loud and it's near my throat. But uh, I do feel twice as better as I did yesterday. So hopefully tomorrow I feel twice as better as I do today. We should be in. I should be. Yeah, you know, I should be able to stream tomorrow. It may not be like super crazy high energy shit, but I should at least be able to fucking push through it. I wish I did the no jumper interview after, after yesterday, uh, after the, UFC, the uh, UFC stream did, just so I could have said, I don't know, it would have been so much more updated, but it was still good nonetheless. I didn't even know they gave shots 
like steroid shots for Colts, but they do. It was fifty dollars because I was actually I'm still under my dad's insurance. I didn't even know. And under his insurance, I'm 23 years old. So this, I have a month left of this insurance. Yeah, right. I'm turning 23 this month or next month. So I was only I was it was only 50 bucks to get the the shot. I'm like, all right. And then I got some medicine as well, some like cold medicine, some like really high like like powerful shit, like better than Tylenol. So I'm taking like six of those a day. Uh, I was just like, yo, doctor, I need something that's gonna make me not sick as soon as possible. So I cannot afford to not be able to talk for a long period of time. And they're like, all right, I got you. Or maybe it's still 25. Huh. Eh, whatever. I, I still, I'm, on, I'm under his insurance regardless, so that's good. I don't got to pay shit. I'm getting old, man. 23 next month. I feel like I feel like I was 19 the other day. All right, there's a thick building right over here. Let's see. Uh, let's just walk inside and see what happens. So 5.4 frequency gigahertz. 5.4 gigahertz frequency. I'm assuming it's less congested because phones use different frequency. Phones don't use 5.4 gigahertz and that's why I would lag because it cell towers be super congested. So if I'm on these modems that have a different frequency, if there's nobody using the frequency, you're less likely to lag, huh? I think they're all on. I, I just, I just, I didn't adjust the modems at all. They just, I plugged them in straight out of the box. So I'm just going to assume they're all, they're all on 5.4 gigahertz. So... Streaming has literally turned me into an IT expert. If streaming ends, I can get a job in an internet provider and actually know what I'm talking about, unlike everyone else. Five gigahertz has really bad building penetration. That's what I heard, but I don't know. We'll see, I guess. Dan Kwan uh, seemed to not have any issues with that. I was told that you know this would be the, the different frequencies would be better, so we'll see. I'm gonna try and go in, I don't wanna go in a parking garage, that's just stupid. Like, I'm obviously gonna disconnect or get pixeled up the ass. 60 frames in a parking garage. <laughs> yeah, I got gun runs help. Let's go inside here and see what happens. I just, I'm, it's gonna get pixelated 100%, but let's see if it lags, like buffers and shit. Seems fine. I mean, it got a little bit pixelated, but hey, we didn't lag out. That's quite interesting. Let's let's go for an even more walk inside here. I mean, the other ones would just disconnect entirely. This this one stays even connected. That's a good sign. Even if it's pixelated, I mean, it's 60 frames, dude. Great, we, now we can do parking garage streams. That's cool. I can, like, steal a car on stream. No, I'm just kidding, but...
But no, I haven't smoked weed in a few days, man. My throat would kill me if I smoked weed, dude. Yeah, I mean, I'd, I'd say 60 frames is worth it, dude, to be honest. I mean, we don't buffer out, we don't lag, we don't buffer, we don't lag. It only gets really, really pixelated inside really fucked up environments like a parking garage or something. So, I mean, I'd say it's worth it. I've tried, I've already tested this on 30 frames. It's completely fine in every, in every way. 30 frames, like, it's just completely fine in, like, every, every kind of way. I need to try, I need to go in a car. I need to like get an Uber and see what happens. Well, yeah, it's not 60 frames when it gets pixelated, but then when it fixes itself, it's 60 frames. So let's go inside. Uh, let's go inside this place. This is a notorious dead zone. Bed Bath and Beyond is a huge fucking dead zone. So let's see uh, what happens. Let's see how dead of a zone it really is. Death Note, dude. I still want to watch that. I have not watched it yet. People say it's shit, but I mean, I'm a huge fucking Death Note fan, so even if it's shit, as long as they try, I'm okay with that. Hi. Is it good, everybody? Wow, that's cool. That is, that is, I'm very impressed. Holy shit. I went to the, I went to Bed Bath & Beyond today, and I bought a new, I bought a, I bought a new comforter. I bought a, a new comforter, dude, and it was it's so good. Never had one before. I've only had a bed sheet and one pillow. It's so comfortable. I feel like I can sleep so well now. I fall asleep so easy. I didn't I didn't know that having actual comfy shit on your bed makes it makes a difference. Okay, let's go even deeper into the into the realm. Let's let's go into this area, which is completely made of cement. Let's see if uh, what happens here. Oh, that's what happens. Okay, maybe that was too deep. I don't think uh, we should go that deep into the uh, abyss of uh, cement. But there's probably an audio delay right now. There probably is an audio delay right now, isn't there? I know how to fix the audio delay, I just have to stream it through VLC instead of through my phone. But. At the moment, I don't give a fuck about streaming through VLC, so if they, I'll just restart it. It's so much easier. Oh, there's no audio delay. Wow. And there was a little bit of connection, I guess. Wow. No delay. Holy shit. That's interesting. All right. Let's see. Let's go into Uber. I don't know. We... That Bed Bath & Beyond is pretty much, it's a pretty hard dead zone, so, I'm, so that's good. Let's, fuck it, let's go inside of Walgreens. I mean, I know Walgreens is a dead zone as well. If I don't disconnect in this Walgreens, I'll be very surprised. I, like, I will be so surprised.
haven't smoked any weed, but I had some CBD, had some little CBD gummy bears as well. Those helped me out a lot, made me feel super good. So thank you to whoever sent those in the P.O. box. Oh wow. Can you hear the environment around me well with this microphone or no? Can you only hear me? Like, can you hear the music and shit? Wow, I'm impressed. This Walgreens is, uh, I mean, where am I? I'm impressed this Walgreens is a dead zone. Look at my GoPro, it's fucked. The screen is broken, you see? Yeah, I know, it sucks. Hey, whatever. Let's go sit down and eat this bagel, hold on. I, I haven't, no, I, I've configured this, I haven't, I mean, the backpack is not complete. This is just, it's super ghetto right now because I'm just testing, but I need to complete the backpack and the cable management and uh, make sure the modems are actually at 5.4 gigahertz, which they clearly are since I didn't disconnect this out of there. I just need to adjust my backpack, put some, logo, some YouTube logo shit on it, and then uh, we're good to go. And the YouTube logo shit's really important, otherwise people think this is a bomb. Because this shit, you, you thought the last setup was ridiculous? I mean, you should see this one. I have so many fucking wires and shit. Hold up. Check check this shit out. Alright, so I've got this bag. Okay, I've got all these fucking wires coming in and out of this bitch. I got this, this bitch just chilling in there. I mean, hopefully it doesn't overheat. I'm gonna try and put an ice pack like right here or something, or like some fans to keep it cool. Uh, but it seems fine right now. This is where I'm keeping all the all the modems. I have a bunch of these motherfuckers. I have like, I have like six of these just chilling, just on a little thing. So uh, that's that you know that's a little bit sketchy. And then I have my battery in then this right here. So yeah, I mean it looks a little bit sketchy for the untrained eye. That's for sure. But it's super clean. I mean. The wires are so clean, like, it, it's not like the last setup where I was tripping over wires and shit. Like, the wires here are super, I got them all cable managed nicely. So. They didn't even toast a bagel, that's fine. You think it's the lighting that causes pixelation? Okay, I'll try, 